Hey, it's David Zarella from Marimax of Norwalk. And if you're watching this video, it's probably because you have uh, maybe a little overheating on your generator. And today I'm going to discuss how to clean out your basket strainer and see if we could uh, resolve that issue of yours. If it doesn't help, by all means, reach out to customer care at marimax.com and one of my service technicians will be more than happy to walk you through it. You have your generator running and you happen to have an overheat. Uh, first thing you would like to do is uh, obviously please let that generator cool down completely. That could be a couple of hours before you could actually mess with the unit itself. But what I would do first and foremost is just close your seacock, which is right here. So you would close this down. That shuts the water flow out. Open your basket strainer. So you would open up your basket strainer. And go on in here and see if there's any debris in here. For example, we got a shell or some sort in here and uh, that actually could clog up your air conditioning system. So you periodically want to clean this out. This is just a prime example of what's inside these basket strainers. So you clean them out. Now and then, it's just typical regular maintenance. Uh, it will basically uh, decrease the water flow through either your air conditioning systems or your generator. So you want to make sure they're nice and clean. You put your system back together. You put the basket strainer back in. You open the seacock. You would like to let the air escape from your basket strainer. Get water to come over the top. That's what you're looking for. If you did not have water that came over the top, that means that your clog could be below the water line um, and something could be outside underneath the bottom of the boat that's restricting the water flow. Being that we just tested it and we had plenty of water flow that came through, that's terrific. You go ahead and put your cap back on top. Again, please, hand tight. Good, snug, hand tight. Don't over tight the plastic cap. And then don't forget to open up the seacock. And then you can go ahead and try to start the generator. 